this is Matt on the Moon Lambo channel. No, your eyes do not deceive you. You are looking at $55,000 Bitcoin on your screen. However, even though your eyes are not deceiving you, this is a glitch. I'm on live coin watch right here, and it keeps jumping back between the real price of about $52,000 and $55,000. I don't know what the hell is going on. I even checked coin market cap, but uh, nothing else was going bonkers. I was like, that is not right, because I just checked like 10 minutes prior, and I was like, yeah, the price was around $52,000. And then I check in, and I'm like, $55,000? No, son. You did, they, they didn't even get me on that one. <laughs> But uh, anyway, uh, I want to share with you some perspectives from a few analysts in this latest Moon Lambo Hot Jam having specifically to do with XRP. Uh, in fact, uh, there is an incredible 20-minute like, breakdown on what to expect uh, for XRP in the short term from uh, one of my favorite analysts out there, Credible Crypto. And uh, kind of in, I'll show you his exact words towards the beginning part of the video and, and share with you some of the key takeaways as I saw it anyway. But uh, basically, if you like making money, he says you should pay attention to XRP. And I don't know about you, but I do like making money. So we will see what happens. But um, before going further, I do want to be clear. I do not have a financial background of any kind. I am not offering financial advice. And you definitely should not buy or sell anything because of anything I say or write. I'm just an enthusiast who enjoys making YouTube videos about crypto-related topics, but just as a hobby and just for fun. As I record this video, XRP is 57 cents, and apparently Bitcoin popped back down as I was recording this, $52,107. Uh, by the way, for anyone curious, at the time I'm recording this, it is 12.43 a.m. Central Time on Tuesday, uh, February 20th, 2024, so early in the a.m. video here. And uh, Crypto Fear and Greed Index at 72 out of 100. And you know what, I'll mention this right now before sharing with you some of what I thought were the key takeaways from, from Credible Crypto. I just want to note that uh, he was asked, do you still think that XRP can run to like at least $10 this market cycle? And he just responded with one word, yes. And so the fact that he hasn't been talking about XRP recently isn't because he lost confidence or was no longer interested. Uh, Credible Crypto, very positive, very bullish on XRP, it's just that he was waiting for a certain something to unfold. Um, and uh, so here you can see he posted uh, 2.57 a.m. February 19th, so about 22 hours ago. He wrote, in my last video update on XRP, I said I was not interested in it until the XRP BTC pairing moved to my downside target some 30 plus percent lower. Well, we are finally there and at a place where I am now interested slash paying attention to it. And so he's, um, he, he's, he's no, it's, it's just, it might, it sounds so ridiculous to some people who are just, um, like the most negative of XRP holders. What? It's a good thing if it goes down XRP BTC. Yes. And he explains why his, this, there's historic precedent for this. And it doesn't mean that XRP was taking an absolute beating compared to the United States dollar, but Bitcoin price has increased. Historically, we, historically, we know Bitcoin leads the way and then XRP plays catch up. This is not exactly surprising. And so tonight he actually did publish a video. And if you want the full technical breakdown, and I encourage you to watch it if you're curious in that type of thing, go to his uh, go to his profile on X, and you can see, just look for the post that's on your screen right now. Um, I'm not going to rehash a bunch of TA for you. I just want to share what I thought to be some of the key takeaways here. But uh, he posted this 6.31 p.m. tonight, and he said, love it or hate it, if you like making money, it may be time to start paying attention to XRP. In the video below, I take a look at the XRP BTC, XRP ETH, and XRP USD charts to make the case for why we may be approaching a period of outperformance on XRP. And indeed, he does think that XRP is going to put Bitcoin to shame when it comes to uh, performance, as historically has been the case, going back a decade, literally. And so it was in late 2023 that Credible Crypto, uh, he published a video talking about XRP, and he said... You know, um, when, when XRP crashed further and was worth, um, what he was targeting was 0.00001224 Bitcoin. So a, a tiny little piece of a Bitcoin. That's when he said that he would be interested in XRP again. And that level has now been hit. In fact, we're a bit below that level, at least at the time that he published this video. And now Credible Crypto is looking for a long setup. He is long XRP. 
And he he does think this is a point where XRP is likely to, you know, show some life. And that was a quote. And, and finally outperform Bitcoin. And look, like I said a minute ago, there is precedent for this going back further than many people realize, actually. It happened during the last cycle. It happened twice in 2017. But you know what? It also happened in 2014. In fact, as he mentioned in his video, in 2014, when uh, XRP was just a little baby new crypto, uh, in the span of about a month, XRP outperformed Bitcoin by sevenfold. Sevenfold. Going back a decade ago. So it looked really bad, really bad, oh, too bad, so sad, until suddenly it wasn't too bad or so sad. And XRP just destroyed Bitcoin in terms of performance. There's a decade's worth of precedent for this. And so as it's been as the XRP BTC chart has been grinding down, that's why it's not a, some sort of negative indicator. But anyway, Credible Crypto thinks in the coming weeks, XRP could put in a 200% gain against Bitcoin so long as in the short term we see a higher low uh, now, now that XRP's reached a credible crypto point of interest since XRP, um, you know, it, XRP has been bleeding out against Bitcoin on, on higher time frames anyway for like the last few years, basically. <laughs> you know, ever since we saw the, the run up uh, 2021 where it did outperform Bitcoin. But, uh, but anyway, he goes on to note that if the first burst of XRP to the upside is successful, and uh, he, he quantifies what that is in his video. So if you're curious again for the nitty gritty, go check out his video. He did a great job articulating the reasons he believes what he believes there. But, uh, you know, if it's successful, then he actually thinks from the current level that we may be looking at something more like an 800% gain against Bitcoin. For, for, from, again, from the current level, 800% gain against Bitcoin. That would be a gigantic move. And uh, look, it, it may take a few weeks, he noted, before XRP starts outperforming Bitcoin, if indeed it's going to happen. Uh, but for a ton of reasons he articulated in the video, like that's what he's seeing in the charts on the XRP BTC chart and the XRP ETH chart. And he said, um, uh, you know, unless uh, you know, unless Bitcoin takes a big dive against the United States dollar, it's unlikely that XRP will take a big dive against the United States dollar too. Why would it? It's just one of those things that, that it's so obvious at this point, but I say it with a certain amount of regularity because it's worth repeating. If Bitcoin's going to have a massive dump in price, altcoins, including XRP, will follow. So then for some period of time, he could probably throw this thing out the window, but he doesn't think that's what's most probable to happen. And so the bottom line, what's most probable, according to Credible Crypto, is a dramatic move to the upside in the short term. And he thinks what's most likely is that XRP will, quote, randomly erupt one day, end quote. And that's how it always goes. I always say that. Uh, which, you know, because, look, frankly, that's how it's always been. Historically, that's that's just how it's always been. And so then there was uh, this. This is what I was uh, mentioning a few minutes ago. Uh, somebody named Clueless Wallop wrote to Credible Crypto and said, Cred, do you still think it can get to $10 this cycle? So asking, can XRP get to at least 10 bucks this cycle? Credible Crypto simply responded, yes. So we're going to know sooner than later. And, you know, there was this article, too. I wanted to mention this from you today titled XRP Brutally Denied. And I don't really need to, to read this thing, but they just note that XRP recently, within the last 24 hours or so, as of the time they published this, hit some rejection, went back down. But we've been talking about this level, right? Because all sorts of analysts have been highlighting this level. The point is 54 cents became resistance. XRP overcame that resistance, moved a bit higher, even recently got as high as 58 cents, but then it came back down and tested uh, that 54 cent level, which is now support, and it held. So you can say here that XRP was brutally denied. Okay, uh, I mean, whatever gets the clicks, I guess. But it, it, <laughs> the truth is, it was likely that it was going to go back down to to, to uh, you know test that support again, and it did successfully. This isn't some sort of bad, negative, scary thing. This is good. This is a positive thing. So it's all about what kind of spin you choose to put on it. I suppose is what it is. And then there was also this perspective from chart analyst Dark Defender. RSI for the XRP BTC pair in the weekly time frame stands in the same place as it did before the 2017 and 2021 XRP bull runs. RSI tells us the 2024 run is here. And so here, looking at it, he's also looking at the XRP BTC pair. I'm just noticing that there, there are a lot of analysts that are coming to fairly similar conclusions. 
And as far as I'm concerned, if I mean, I, and I do think history kind of rhymes with itself, generally speaking, not that it perfectly repeats, but given that we know how XRP has been treated consistently for a decade, why wouldn't it, we just wake up one day and it's just running and it's starting to melt faces? That would be, it is actually, that, that's literally my expectation. I don't know what day it's going to be, which is why I love my approach when it comes to investing, just buy stuff and then don't do anything, literally nothing. That's what I do for myself anyway. And then there have been a number of times in my six plus years in crypto where you do wake up and it is one of those exciting fun days and it just rips. XRP just rips to the upside. You know, putting the haters to shame. And it's funny because <laughs> all the little punk ass bitches and <laughs> the Bitcoin maxi trolls, what I notice when that happens is they shut the hell up. They are nowhere to be found on social media. Oh my God, they're noisy and they're rude and bankers coin this, bankers coin that, which is funny because Bitcoin's the bankers coin now. But uh, setting that aside still, um, they shut the hell up and we get to have a lot of fun and maybe a little bit of gloating. There's been, there may be a little bit of gloating going throughout the community. And I say fair enough. <laughs> uh, so anyway, we're, we're going to find out soon enough what happens here. But again, it's just more reason to believe that um, we are going to be getting ours. If the market's going to continue to move higher, especially if Bitcoin's going to get hit, hit new all-time highs, which Credible Crypto firmly believes is going to happen. In fact, he thinks there's a reasonable chance it'll happen, but happen before the halving, which is going to be around April 20th. I mean, that happens. Why the hell wouldn't XRP? Because, my God. That, see, when you, when you start t talking about getting back to that price level of Bitcoin around all-time high, that is when you're really going to start attracting uh, new eyeballs to the crypto space that's when you're going to because look, and I've been sharing the data recently, like their retail, it's not been increased. It just, it hasn't. You can look at the Coinbase numbers. It hasn't been increasing. And so unless this is the first time where we had a, a, a bull run where just, you don't get new people participate, I mean, I guess, okay, if that happens. Uh, but, you know, a big part of what's going to control that is just seeing what happens more so on a macro scale. What's going to happen when it comes to equities? Because again, as I've said many times, and it's worth repeating here, because it's a crucial point, equities and crypto move in tandem, in particular for the biggest of moves. So as long as stocks are going to keep climbing higher, I think that it's a virtual certainty that crypto will. Bitcoin will lead the way, hit a new all-time high, and then we're going to have a blow-off top. Now, if we don't see that with equities, well, okay, then fine. Then I guess this really is all she wrote, and then see you in a few years or something like that. But uh, I'm... I'm optimistic we're going to have a good 2024. And, you know, even if it comes to that, you could still see some blow-off tops with alts. In fact, we've been seeing a bit of that today. So there's still potential, even if there isn't going to be a new all-time high. It's just we're going to have to sit back and see who's right because there's been some fierce debate amongst the analysts on that front. And I don't pretend to know for sure what's going to happen, but I'm, I'm, I'm optimistic. We'll see what goes. See what goes down. I'm not a financial advisor. You should not buy or sell anything because of anything I say, right? That would be a very, very, very bad idea. Until next time, to the moon, Lambo.